Me there. Oh, oh, there. oh, oh here we go. Oh, some Darth Maul yes. action. Here we go, folks. This Darth Maul. This is where Maul. it starts to get interesting. This is gets scary. Darth Maul will excel in phase two and phase three as you're inside. I mean, he's a great mobile attacker. He's going to sit there with his such lightsaber. Close quarters too. So oh, exactly. He's absolutely perfect for that. Absolutely. I mean, some of his abilities you can see here. He's got that spin attack. He's able to woo, just rush in and out of combat and just take guys out in the, in the process. It was funny. I was talking to Musa earlier, and he was using Darth Maul, and he was saying how there's Boba Fett as well. Uh, but he was talking about how he wishes Darth Maul could reflect. I was like, if he could reflect, he'd be too strong. Too <laughs> he'd be way too strong. Oh, oh there goes Boba Fett. Like, that was a good flank by Boba Fett and Maul. Just shredded the clone army, unfortunately. They so are. what role does Boba Fett fill in this battle? Boba Fett is definitely a hunter-killer. So if, if the other, if the clone army is able to get some of their heroes in play, like this is where Boba Fett will really shine. Is with that jetpack of his, he's able to kind of float above the battlefield, uh, fire off some rockets, and really just take out an individual target. So what difference does he have from the last game? Uh, from the last game, we've given him a bit of new tricks. Uh, he's got a new concussion rocket that will really disorient players completely. But he also has this rocket barrage. Instead of just one rocket, he's able to really just lay down his impressive fire. Nice. Also, one thing to keep in mind, we saw the B2, here we go. But on the uh, clone side, you know, there are specialist, uh, you know, characters that you can pick up as well. We haven't seen much of it yet, but that would be uh, the clone jump trooper. That's right. Very that's different right. from the standard like assault class or heavy class. It has the jump jets that you love from Battlefront, the original. That's right. Uh, brought back here, but now focused on the central class. Exactly. Yeah, we're back to Boba Fett here with the Ooh, look at rocket jumps there. <laughs> He's shredding. He will just lay down so much firepower. It's intense. Oh, oh they got him though. Down. Jesse was able to find him on that one, yep. but here comes some officer gameplay here. Oh, good. Finally, somebody playing some support. Support people matter too. They you do. Know? They you do. gotta give them some love. We're the linchpin of the team, you know. Yeah, exactly. Now, what is his two exactly? His two is the healing. His two ability is that. Yeah, exactly. It's that healing ability. It gives you a little bit of buff uh, for your a little over health, but it also heals you back up. So it's. Oh, yeah, we got some of the the jump troopers. Oh boy, and here we go. It's uh, getting it ready is. for phase three in just a little bit. There's a jump trooper. We talked about him before. Jump trooper, super fun to play. Uh, but again, you know, it's attached to a specialist now, uh, so not everyone's going to have it equipped, although it was really fun in the original battle. That's right. But I am going to be excited to hop into jump trooper and shred people myself. I mean, I know people, we love this, people, a lot of people love the jump pack. Oh, oh geez. now we've got Ray. Oh. Not going to lie, I'm super excited to play as her. Uh, she's she's a, quite a powerful character. Don't run. Some of her she got, uh, you know, she got out of that one really Don't quickly, run. quickly, but oh, oh, oh they got oh, her. Man. The droid. Fallen by a Finish simple droid. Off. No, but Ray so has, how does her Ray has mind trick affect yeah. enemies? Absolutely. So Ray's mind trick is, is something that against uh, all enemies, they'll be confused for a little bit. And your controls will kind of you know work against you, making you a little bit more vulnerable to attack. Just so you guys know, this is when it gets insane. <laughs> because they there's so much going on here. And oh, was Ooh. that was that a little Han? We saw a little Han, yeah. Are we gonna get some Han? I hope so. I hope so. But I mean, you, you saw it earlier, so every time uh, you finish a life, we'll show you how many battle points you have, and some people have enough points to get those reinforcements, and especially this late in the game, you'll see a lot more of these special classes coming out, a lot more of the heroes coming out. So again, this jump trooper here, you know, with his rocket launcher and his jump pack, trying to be mobile, trying to fly into that, that last zone and, and capture a point. This is really where heavies are, are going to thrive as well, because there they, is. They, oh my goodness, you just, just see laying down fire through the doorway. Just absolutely dominating the clones. They need to push out. They, they need to there. fight this one out here. There are so many lives left that the separatists have to their team. They could really run through this. The clones have to start acting fast because if they cap it, that will be it. The separatists will win this game. It's not looking so good for my boys in the clone army. I'm a separatist fan. So I'm excited. I'm just going to go on whichever team wins. Oh, okay. So okay. I'm not going to be too picky here. Okay, you should jump and ship. I understand that. You know, no loyalties. Maybe you are Sith after all. Ooh. Maybe I am. Oh, who knows? Shots fired. Shots fired. Uh, well, yeah, so in, the, in this third phase, though, in the, the, the droids are trying to capture that throne room. So you can see here, if you remember, it's just, this, is the main, this is the main throne. And this uh, is such super close quarters. Do you have any, like, sort of strategies that you would... Uh, Absolutely. I mean, if, you're the, if you're the clones, oh, you're oh. hoping that, oh, geez. Han Solo's just this getting is, torn up. This is going to be trouble. <laughs> it's like too soon, man. I can't relive Force Awakens again, you know? Like, don't do it. Darth Maul is just destroying absolutely everything. everything. I mean, is there any tips to, like, taking him down? I mean, you want to have a try to combine arms fire. Oh. oh. The tip is blasters. Run away. Maybe <laughs> run away. Run away and just shoot <laughs> the crap out of Darth Maul. Oh, oh man. man. He was our MVP. Look at that.